and welcome to a video about Arc Linux B. Arc Linux B gives you all the power you need to build Arc Linux yourself the way you want it. And you have lots of tutorials already and ISOs you can build. You can build Arc Linux ISO with changes, no changes. But this one is going to be about a new idea I had. Let's make these Arc Linux B ISOs and provide it with a bunch of software, the software we use all the time. And then we are making a minimal mode, which is around 600, 700 megabyte less, and you install whatever you want. So this is a minimal version, still probably not your version, your choice. It will never be your choice for 100%, but it's meant to be built. It's meant to be edited and changed by you. So this is a distro where you get a personalized ISO. All you have to do is follow a few steps. So there are three already here. I've uh, made tutorials about that. And there is two more that we can have a look at. BSPWM has a mini version, a minimal version, and Plasma as well. And ben Plasma, of course, benefits since it's already 2.6 gig or something like that. But that's for another tutorial. This is going to be about BSPWM. So this one first. What do you do? You follow these links. These links are coming from Arco Linux B, B to build. And we have here a git clone that we should do. So control C. Let's move that to the other screen. We're on our uh, desktop. Right mouse click, maybe, you know, um, open your window, go to your desktop. And then in here you say open a terminal. You copy paste, control shift V, this thing in here means they get all the data from online that's what happens the github is now on your system and then the thing you need to do is go inside here packages 86 etc and then you scroll down and you say for instance let's give an example vivaldi you don't like vivaldi you put a hashtag in front of it it's a bad idea but hey uh, no just joking but uh, there is a new release of vivaldi Finally, the, the Vivaldi snapshot syncing to the cloud is there. So I'm loving it even more now. So Vivaldi is out. Well, we need to have something, right? So Firefox is then in, and that's how you should proceed. And GIMP is normally out. So GIMP, all right, has a hashtag. No, no, I want to have GIMP, and that's how you do it, all right? So Control Z, Control Z, Control Z. Everything is, is back as it was. So you see how many gigabytes it is. So this is the minimal version, the way we see fit, uh, we see it, and, and you choose anything you want and add it and even more, change more icons, add more icons, less icons. It's all up to you. So once that's done, what do you do? You go up and you say installation scripts and you run this installation script. And it's just a matter of waiting. So number 30, build it, give in your password and wait for it. On the form, we are starting to get um, more and more questions about Arc Linux B. You check out the part where it's only about Arc Linux B. And at the top, we are gathering all the errors that people are asking. Hey, is this an error? No, that's not an error. That's normal. Or I get this error. Ah, you should reboot. You had got a new kernel in, you should reboot, stuff like that. So things that we've, um, well, we know that will happen to users. Well, post it, make a forum, post on it, and uh, you check that out. So help is on the forum, on Discord as well. And on the website, don't forget Arcalinux B itself. It's going to be a long video if you want to wait for all this, so I'm going to wait for the ISO to pop out so at the very very end because the at the end it's going to write an ISO and it, it's going to take 100% of my CPU so recording at that point in time will be awful so I'll wait that, till everything is finished so what do you do while it's working well I went to it it's simple as that so we have here Arc Linux B 18.10.2 and 1.4 gig so we went from uh, let's say around 2 gigabytes to 1.4 it's a 600 megabyte that we have eliminated with our minimal addition 
Now, um, lately we've um, made a new folder. So if we go to Eric, Control H, there is an Eric Linux D out, an Eric Linux B out, and another one Eric Linux out. So it's going to be in here, what we've created. And just to show you, it's now 1419. And I'll better put Discord off for the moment. Bye, guys. So minimal from three minutes ago. I had a bite. And um, there you have it. The only thing we need to do is actually to well, load it up in VirtualBox and see if we like it or not. So, Super F7 here, I load it up. Let's see, can I move it? Yes. Um, pop, pop, pop. So this one is the minimal. Choose the disk image. That's the last one. Let's check anyway. Two o'clock, 16. And we are the 30th. Correct. Double click. And of course, it opens on the other screen fun of two screens so there you go and he remembers he should stay here so i'm not going to go over the installation of everything let's just wait for the pop-up and calamaris to appear and it's just business as usual you just install your system all right enjoy <laughs> 